Hi everyone and welcome to this session. Today we will see how to deal with enumeration in Hibernate. So let's get started. So I prepared one example. I defined this entity job history with three fields. One of them is of type job status. It is an enumeration and it has three values, successful, failed, running. So without adding any annotation, we will run the example. So the job history is annotated with table. So the table name will be job history. So let's run this example and I'm using each two database. And we see here that one row has been inserted. Let's check it. Indeed, so the status is zero because the ordinal of my value successful in in the enumeration is the first one. If we, ch we change here to running, for example, we can change that and see. Let's stop the H2 database and run the example. And we see again one. So in the persistent, so each time I run the example, table drop it and new created. And let's see the result. And you see indeed it is two. So uh, if you want to, to save the enumeration string value instead of the ordinal value, you can use this annotation. enumerated enum type the default one if you don't use this is ordinal so let's try now with enum type equal to string we will stop and run it again we check the result one record has been inserted and you see indeed, so the value is inserted instead instead of the ordinal value. So I, I prefer I prefer to use so in my opinion I prefer to use the enum type string because uh, in your enumeration you don't need to put uh, the values in specific order. You can you can take a successful here. You can add new one here and noting so uh, it is definitely uh, much better than using ordinal however uh, in some situation you want to save a value for example let's define an integer seven is for seven is for running and three failed, failed. this is only of sake of demonstrating the issue or this example and you need to define construct value and value and, and uh, define constructor status and value and you specify this value equal to value and also you have to provide this one so you see this small warning this one should be final private final i will and you need to define this function and get value to return this value so we have this one to make Hibernate use persist this value instead of this one, uh, there is a new feature in GPA 2.1. So I prepared this converter. So there is you have to provide a class, for example, enum converter that implements this one. And this is from GPA uh, specification, and this class should be annotated 
with converter with this annotation it's provide to a method that you have to implement you have to implement this method convert to database column and you have to do the same here and when Hibernate try to search for the enumeration using the value I'm just using this so uh, looping over the enumeration values and and I'm checking which one has the same string value I'm using here stream optional and I'm returning the correct enumeration so let's run it and see I'm expecting it will not work because uh, this is I will I will explain that for you first let's stop the database and start it again yeah okay let's check so the result running there is no change why because this is a bit uh, confusing because uh, if you want to use this conver converter you have to remove this annotation so this field shouldn't be annotated by enumerated so let's try it again and let's see if it works one row has been inserted let's check and you see four so four is exactly correspond to running this feature is new in hibernate uh, in in gpe21 specification so this is all for today thank you for watching and bye